Hello, chicken friends. Thought I'd come out and make a little video and give you an update on how the babies are doing. Are you trapped in there? You know, chickens are not always the brightest. You can walk around. We're just going to let you work that out. Um, I'm going to give you an update on the chicks and our project. Now, if you don't watch our channel, you won't know what I'm talking about. So, here's what we're about to do. This is my chicken coop. It used to be a single car garage, then it became my workshop, and now it has gone to the chickens. So it's insulated. It's a fantastic setup for a chicken coop. But the ceiling is very, very tall. It goes up like, I want to say 11 feet. So it holds heat. I live in the south. Not a good idea. So this is my little uh, chick pen for the moment, which will be getting taken down when these girls get old enough to incorporate with the big girls. But this garage door, we like to open it when it's, when it's warm outside. Now today, for whatever reason, in the last couple of days, it's been chilly, which is a little odd for the South, but it's only been in the 60s. So I haven't opened it just because the babies are in here. Normally it's open, but what we've decided to do is put a screen or a hardware cloth door on the front. So it will be framed in by wood. We've got the frame finished. I uh, have not been able to seal it yet because it's been raining for the past two days. So that's delayed me a little bit. Hopefully I might, I think it's gonna clear up. Might be able to get a coat of sealant on it uh, maybe later today, but if not, I will get it done tomorrow because it's going to be beautiful tomorrow. So that's going to happen. So I will be making a video on the uh, new entryway. That way, when we get that up, we're going to be able to leave this door open all the time. Well, when the weather is nice. So, or I should say when the weather's hot. And that way, my girls will not be sitting in here baking like an oven because if they're up there on the top of that roost and it only gets down to 80 something degrees at night, it's gonna be hot up there and I want my girls to be comfortable. So that is what's going on with the project. It be watching for a video of that later this week. But as far as the babies go, they are doing fantastic. I, I brought my taller X-Pen in here because I had a two foot one in here yesterday just to give them a little extra space. And uh, they figured out real quick they could fly to the top of that. So I've just added this on for just, you know, while I'm out here. So they'll have a little bit more space because they are little maniacs. They love to fly around and literally spread their wings. So they're doing great. Everybody's growing. Everybody's healthy. I am still a little concerned. And I'm hoping that I'll know by the end of the week next week that uh, Caroline, which is right there. Uh, black copper marin might be a rooster. Of course, these were all purchased as pullets, but if you own chickens, you know, you know, you always run the risk. So she's doing good though too, but I'm just hoping for the best that I've got a group of pullets because I am not supposed to have roosters in my county. So cross your fingers for me, guys. But other than that, they are doing fantastic, healthy, thriving, playing, eating, of course, pooping. So, uh, anyway, if you guys are enjoying our content and you love watching these babies and my big girls as well, please like and subscribe. And uh, I hope you all have a fantastic day. And I'll see you on the next video.